Well, hello, YouTube. Eugene here with a review on the Kikai Sentai Zenkai Jiu Zenkai Hinchinju DX Gear to Linger. Yes, friends, let's go ahead and take a box. Right here says Kikai Sentai Zenkai Jiu, and right here says Zenkai Hinchinju DX Gear to Linger. Right here just does indicate we do have licensed sounds with the Gear to Linger. Got a nice shot of Zenkaiser and a nice shot of the Gear to Linger itself. Right here, this does indicate we do have a Sentai gear, but in our case here, we have two, which are the Zenkaiser gear and the Zenkai Duran gear. And so here's the top of the box. Here's the bottom of the box. Here's the side of the box. Here's the other side of the box. And here is the back of the box. There's pretty much everything I'm going to be showing you in this review of the gear to linger. All right, friends, so the Gear to Linger is the 5 Zenkaiju transformation device and sidearm weapon that is modeled after a hand-cranked Gatling gun. Now, this changer does require a gimmick, and that is this year's Sentai's collectible gimmick known as the Sentai Gears, which are based on previous Super Sentai installments. Also, this goes along so well with the theme of Zenkaiju, which is robots and mechanical devices. So the Gear to Linger has an interesting design, and it's a design I like. Now, motif-wise, it is somewhat similar to the Hawk Gantlinger used by Kamen Rider Build. And I'm getting a little vibe of the Dry Gun from Nippu Sentai Hurricaner, which is Hurricane Red's weapon. And uh, so the name Gear to Linger is a poor mantle coming from Gear, Tori, which is Japanese for bird, Gantlinger, and Er, or E-R. And so past hinging devices usually ended in E-R, like Changer. But friends, I will have that in my text uh, just to help you out there. But I've always wondered how they got the name for this changer. And it makes so much sense here. So the overall color scheme of the Gear to Linger is red and black. And so starting at the barrels, got that nice silver paint for the barrels. And then on the side of the barrels of the Gear to Linger has the five colors, pretty much which are red yellow, green, blue, and pink. And pretty much reminiscent the colors of the first Sentai, which is Human Sentai Go Ranger. And so anyway, got the nice bird head on the top as a beak uh, in a nice speckled gold. And uh, right here uh, is where your lights will be coming from, which is in that transparent plastic for the eye. Got bits of black here. And so, uh, anyway, right here, um, you can see the handle to the crank in a transparent plastic. And we got the uh, Zenkaiger emblem on the handle, done in a nice chrome gold. This section here is for the collectible gimmick known as the Sentai Gear, which is also done in that transparent plastic. And so, uh, right here on the side, here it says Gear to Linger on this multicolor sticker and showing us on how it is spelled. And I like that, Gear to Linger. And so, uh, anyway, here is your trigger and then here is your handle. And right here is your battery compartment, which takes two AAA batteries. And then um, on the back here uh, is your on and off switch. And then the speaker for the sounds is on the other side of the changer. We also have these panels that flip down on the first handle of the uh, gear to linger. And uh, right here, it reveals to us this nice bullet detailings. And I think this feature will help it pretty much for the sake of it to stand like a Gatling does. Um, and so here's a little point here. I mean, it does stand real good with the panels down, but... Uh, whenever I flip the panels up, it still could stand. So, but, uh, and I think they did that to interact as an actual, what an actual Gatlin does. So, um, anyway, so, um, and I'm going to turn it this way here. But whenever you crank the handle, the barrels will rotate, showing those nice five colors as a slide show, like, you know. And then, uh, not only does this rotate when you crank the handle, but the inside where the gear will be at rotates as well. So overall, friends, it's a nice looking changer in some weird parts. But to be honest with you, I totally dig it. And I cannot wait for you to hear the sounds of this nice changer.
also friends the gear tillinger has a nice feel in my hands to say that i have big man hands and again i'm gonna say this but the detailings on this changer looks really really nice on both sides uh even on this side as well even though it just has the speaker on this side and then uh, on the bottom and on the top so here are this sentai's collectible gimmick and these are called sentai gears and you can tell why they are called that because they are gears and these are the reason the changer functions and so the gear tillinger comes with the zenkaiser gear and the zenkai duran gear and so we'll start off by taking a look at the zenkaiser gear and as you can see uh, it's got Zenkaiser there with the number 45 because Zenkaiser is the 45th Sentai. The gear itself uh, done in a gold plastic. The image done in a chrome white with that nice sparkly sparkly which is very pretty. I really love that. And so anyway, well on the back of the Sentai gear here, uh, as you can uh, see, it's got the uh, Zenkaiser emblem in that nice chrome gold. And uh, right here on the top, I don't know if my camera is catching it, but it's got B and 01 stamped there. So meaning it's a DX gear. So here is the Zenkai Duran gear. As you can see, got the number 16 representing Duranger in that nice chrome red with Zenkai Duran's picture on it in that gold plastic. And that red is more of a metallic, but doesn't have that sparkly sparkly like the Zenkaiser gear, as that is the only gear to have that, and is uh, pretty much it's representing both the 45th Sentai and the anniversary of Sentai. And so on the back of the gear, uh, you can see got the uh, Zenkaiser emblem in that chrome gold again, looks really nice. And uh, I'm going to get a close up here and I'm hoping to God my camera's focusing in real good here. But it's got B and 02 stamped there. And um, I got to say that the gold plastic looks great on the gears. Pretty much both front and back. But on the show, on the show, it has more like a chrome gold shine to it. But all in all, I love these gears. I really do. They look really cool here. And we're going to have fun here with this Sentai here. Now let's do the sounds and we'll start off by turning it on and so let's have fun. So here we go. Sweet. And let's do it again. So the name of the changer and we have some fanfare sounds after. And so uh, and pretty much this will help us on how to pronounce the name of the gear to linger. And so, uh, let's go ahead and hit the trigger. Some firing noises, and that's pretty much it. And so, let's go ahead and crank the handle. And as you can see, nothing happens without any gear. So, it's nothing without the gimmick. So, how these Sentai gears work in the changer? Well, friends, it's pretty much the sides of the gears that's different as you can see it's got like little different tabs on both the gears and so if it spins it gets read by the side reader in the changer and so anyway so we'll open this up this uh, section up makes that noise there we'll close it closing noise opening closing and so anyway so this is the spot for the gears so with the different sides of the gears and so right here um, is the side reader which are two buttons uh, pretty much a bottom one and a top one in the changer and that's how the gears uh, will get recognized by the changer because of the different sides of the gears with just the two buttons in the changer so now Let's put the Zenkaiser gear to do the hinching. And so uh, we'll go ahead and close it in. And so let's do it. We'll go ahead and crank the handle. So here we go. Change Zenkai. So cool. So let's hit the trigger. Mm. 
<laughs> that henchin really tickles me. Now that's cool. The melody of the transformation standby music are remixes of the opening and ending theme songs of Himitsu Sentai Go Ranger. Really like that. I really do. And so now that we got a gear in the changer now, we can have more action here with the trigger. And so we can go ahead now and hold the trigger. Charging sounds. And so we'll hit again. With an even bigger explosion. And so we'll hold the trigger again. And then we'll crank the handle. For like Gantling firing sounds with the R's. I think that's really cool. And that really does tickle me. Just about everything of this changer really tickles me. And so now we'll go ahead and crank the handle for the final attack sound. So here we go. All right, hit the trigger. So that's cool. So uh, anyway, this side here is called Hero Side with the number uh, season. Now let's flip flop the gear to the emblem side, which is called Kinkai Side. And so uh, just to do more fun here. So let's go ahead and uh, crank, uh, crank the handle. Sound like a charging sound. Hit the trigger. Cool. And so let's go ahead and crank up the uh, the handle again for the final attack of the mecha. And hit the trigger. So Hero Side is pretty much the henchin and final attack for the Zenkaijers. And Kinkai Side is the Zenkai Guntite and the final attack with the Mecha. So, here we go with the next gear uh, that comes with the gear to linger. And so here we go with the Zenkai Juran gear. And so it's pretty much the same pattern as the Zenkaiser gear. So let's go ahead and crank the handle. And so here we go. Change Zenkai. And hit the trigger. Still love that standing by sound, I really do. And so now let's go ahead and crank the handle again for the final attack of the Zenkaiger, or here in our case here, Zenkai Juran. So here we go. Okay. Cool. So we're hearing different sounds than we did with the Zenkaiser gear. So let's go ahead now and since we do have a, a, a gear in it, let's see if anything has changed with the trigger attack here. So let's go ahead and hold the trigger. Charging sounds and hit the trigger again. With bigger explosions. So we'll go ahead and hold the trigger again. Pretty much for the cranking here. Of the Gatling fire sounds with the R. So nothing's really changed. So same thing with the trigger action here that we've seen from with the Zenkaiser gear. So let's go ahead now and flip over the gear from Hero side to Kinkai side. So here we go. And go ahead and uh, turn the uh, crank the handle. Okay, hit the trigger. Okay, 
Okay, and for the last time, let's go ahead and turn the handle mainly for the final attack uh, with the Mecha. So here we go. And hit the trigger. So friends, the same pattern as the Zenkaiser gear. And I really dig the sounds here. I really do. Awesome. Well, friends, my final thoughts, I pretty much gave you all my input, alters, if you how I feel about this changer and everything. But again, nice changer overall, and I love the gimmick we got this year, and that's the Sentai Gears, which goes along so well with the theme of Zenkaiger. And of course, the fact it's a anniversary Sentai, and it's perfect. Love the sounds and the remix version of the Go Ranger opening ending theme song with the standing by sound, which was clever of them. So yes, friends, I do 100% recommend the Gear to Linger, but you can also have it either both ways as individually or in a set with the Zenkai Buckle. So that's if you really want all five Zenkai Gears. But friends, I'll be honest with you, it's going to be a fun year collecting Sentai Gears as I am looking so forward to this. And so, anyway, and the one cool thing I like about this, it has a real awesome vibe of Go Ranger in it. So, anyway, friends, so all I gotta say is, friends, good luck and happy hunting. And so, friends, that is it for this review. Please check out my blog, and make sure, friends, you hit that bell. I want to upload a new video. And, of course, my friends, this review on the Kikai Sentai Zenkai Jir, Zenkai Hichiju DX Gear to Linger. I hope you enjoy well, friends, I'm Eugene. I'm signing up today, and my friends, almost assuredly, see you next time. 
Bye, friends.